Ukraine is the perfect country for Russia to invade. What's going on everybody? My name is Marcus Obiata. I was a former combat engineer in the 101st Airborne, and today I want to talk about why Ukraine is the perfect country for Russia to invade. I want to start this video by saying I do not support wars, I think wars are terrible, and I hate what's going on between Russia and Ukraine. However, why is Russia picking on Ukraine so much? There has to be a reason. And I think these are the reasons why Russia feels so comfortable attacking Ukraine. Ukraine is the second largest country in Europe next to Russia. That is a good thing for Russia. That's a lot of farmland, they have coastlines, and if they can get a foothold inside Ukraine, they can get closer and closer to the middle of Europe. Having coastlines is invaluable to a country. Russia would love nothing more than to have more coastlines because they lack what's called warm water ports. Have you ever wondered why Russia is so invested in Syria? It's because they have warm water ports. And one thing about Russia, their navy is very hard to maintain when they have all these cold water ports. So by adding more coastline to their navy, they can just add more ships, more personnel, and try to get some more warm water ports. Ukraine also borders a lot of countries into Europe and really cuts into almost the middle of Europe. This is perfect for Russia because then they can do something militarily or tactically to really get a stronghold into Europe. Another reason why Ukraine is the perfect target for Russia, Ukraine is the second poorest country as of 2021 in all of Europe. This means Ukraine really relies on allies to support their military efforts. Ironically, Ukraine has one of the biggest militaries in Europe, however, it's very hard to fund your military when you have such a low economy. Luckily for Ukraine, there's a lot of pride and patriotism within the country, so people are willing to fight for free. There's also a lot of allies that support Ukraine, and Russia hates this. Nonetheless, Russia knows Ukraine's economy is horrible. Russia's not doing that well either, but they're doing a lot better than Ukraine, and they know that Ukraine really can't support this war effort for too long. Ukraine is the perfect scapegoat for Russia. There's been tension since 2014 between Russia and Ukraine, and Russia knows they can really use this as an excuse to full-on attack Ukraine. So Russia knows they can keep poking the bear at Ukraine and hope Ukraine makes a mistake. Maybe Ukraine will send a missile into Russia. Maybe Ukraine will accidentally kill some Russian civilians, and Russia can say, hey, you know what? We're gonna attack Ukraine because they can't be trusted. Ukraine is also not a part of NATO. Even though Russia has some issues with NATO, Ukraine has issues with NATO as well. Ukraine has really been wanting to join NATO, however there's been a lot of corruption and weird political things going on to where they really have not been able to get into NATO. However, NATO has been really supportive of Ukraine during this whole Russia-Ukraine conflict. Russia knows this, so I think they're just trying to poke the bear to see how much NATO really cares about Ukraine. However, ironically, Russia hates the fact that NATO is supporting Ukraine, but why is NATO not supporting Russia? This all sounds really childish, however, I think Russia is very smart in knowing exactly why they are picking Ukraine as their target. I hope nothing happens, and I really hope this all ends soon. I don't want to see any more people dying or any more wars in that region. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. Please send me your comments. Let me know what you guys think. Like the video. Please subscribe, and I'll see you guys later.